Hello guys, it's Ray J and in this video I will show you how to format your 64GB SD card or memory stick to FAT32. Now this will also work on 128GB and 256GB so you'll be good on that front. So you may have realised that when you try to format your 64GB memory stick or SD card and over into FAT32, Windows just doesn't have the option for it. I did make a previous version of this video, however this is a new and updated version of that video, using a completely free and very lightweight program known as GUI Format created by Ridgecrop. So if we go to my computer and look under storage, you'll notice that your memory stick or SD card is currently right there. However, when we right click on it and select Format, and if you have a look at the options for formatting, only NTFS and XFAT are shown. Now this particular memory card is on XFAT. Now I know in command line you are able to format into FAT32, however this is only available on a 32GB memory stick or SD card. Apart from this you can't format into FAT32 in command line with anything higher in storage size, so that is quite an issue. So to resolve this you want to click on the link in the description and then you want to click right here and download the file. Now because the file is so small it will literally download instantly. Like I said this is completely free and it is very lightweight. So for anyone wondering if this program is safe, yes it is completely safe and as you can see I've just run a scan using Kaspersky and nothing shows up at all. Like I said this program is really lightweight and clean. Just to bear in mind as well, if you do have an SD card make sure that write protection is off so you can format it. So all you want to do is go ahead and run the program by double clicking on it. Hit yes and wait for the program to load up. As you can see you're given a few options. So under drive, select the memory stick or SD card that you'll be using. Please make sure that you know exactly what the drive letter is. You can find this by going back onto my computer, under storage and viewing the SD card or memory stick. So going back onto the program, for allocation unit size, I'm just going to leave it at its default which is at 32, however you could also put this up to its highest, that is shown as I've done this in the past and it works just fine. Go ahead and type in a chosen volume name if you want to do so and then either leave quick format selected or untick it. I personally just use quick format so in this video I'll be doing that and I'd probably recommend that you do that too. Once you're settled on everything above simply just hit start and it will format the drive. So if you receive this error message here like I have then make sure to close anything open that may be using your drive. For example my computer which is showing the device currently. Once that's been closed, you can hit start and it'll work straight away. Just make sure to close anything that's using the drive. So now if you go back onto my computer and look under storage, you'll see that the drive is still there. However, if you right click and select properties, you'll now see that the chosen drive is in FAT32. You'll now be able to use this on systems that only accept FAT32. I hope you found this video useful guys and if you did then please leave a like and subscribe whilst making sure that the bell notification is selected as on to see more tech related content each week as it does mean a lot. Hope you have a great day and I'll see you around. This has been a Ray J.